Apollo 10 was essentially a full dress rehearsal for the historic Apollo 11 mission. It was tasked with testing all the components and procedures just short of actually landing on the moon. The commander of the mission, Thomas P. Stafford, a seasoned astronaut, was at the helm. John W. Young, the command module pilot, was responsible for orbiting the moon in the command module Charlie Brown, while Stafford and Eugene A. Cernan, the lunar module pilot, descended towards the moon in the lunar module affectionately named Snoopy. Snoopy, detached from Charlie Brown, and descended to just 8.4 nautical miles from the moon's surface. It was the closest any human had been to the moon at the time. As they descended, they tested the lunar module systems and radar, and captured detailed images and data about the lunar surface. After a nail-biting eight hours, Snoopy ascended, redocked with the command module, and the crew prepared for their journey back to Earth. The successful docking in lunar orbit was a critical milestone demonstrating that a moon landing was indeed possible.